these are the different databases and their purposes, what they use. And uh, for example, uh, the other day I showed you how to check who logs in, who logs out, logged out, and what they did. That for CloudTrail. CloudTrail using DocumentDB to analyze and show you all this data. Every event is a JSON document. It will be stored in a database. Whenever you go here and search, the JSON document will be opened and it will print on your screen. Who did what? Okay, now moving forward to the databases. So what, what is the takeaway from here? In AWS, we will have different databases. If you take any example of any application today's world, they will use more than one database type. One is SQL, the other one is NoSQL. And could be different based on the different applications, the nature of application what they have developed. Here is a complete theoretical understanding on each service, mode insights, RTS, Redshift, DynamoDB, Elastic Cache, Keyspaces, Neptune, Time Series. This is Ledger database. QLDB is a Ledger database. Graph is Neptune. Time Series, Time Series data. White column, Keyspaces. And it is being used where? You see, here is a purpose, use case. Document DB is MongoDB. Document is division of the MongoDB is used part of content management, catalogs, user profiles. That means Facebook users, Insta users. If you want caching mechanism, geo gospel, geo, um, geo hospital applications, leaderboards, gaming, for that in memory is needed, in memory is being used. Key value pair, high web applications, e-commerce business. Of course, in order to log into e-commerce business versus relational database, username and password. That also you can handle with the help of NoSQL database, means DynamoDB. That we have a proof. We are using NoSQL, we are using SQL data. 